but for the final podium position as things stand, it's less than 10 seconds. Cracking stuff. LMP2 Pro Am, Alex Quinn leads Varga Pro Racing from Ben Fiscal for Proton. Nielsen Racing's Nick Yellerly is in third. AF Corsa, they sit fourth. I think that would be good enough for the title if it finished here, because they're ahead of TDS. A rich on by TDS. Bernardo Pinheiro is holding station, pulling back the odd 10th on Adam Alley. Gail Julien, by the way. That's cost him about 15 to 20 seconds in that push. Side by side, though, here for the title contenders in LB2 Pro Am. Nip and tuck, big lock up for the number 29 car on the outside line. So uh, a trail of tyre smoke in behind. But uh, these guys are have been around the block a few times now. Now there's the five car in the way. Oh, and then more of a touch, and the, the 29 wants the middle of the road. So they're still getting into one another. Phenomenal car control there, particularly from Matcha Vaxivier. And, well, Francois Perodo can barely watch. A little too forceful, perhaps, from Matthias Besch, but he wanted the, the middle of the road and wanted to be overlapping the number five car of Daniel Alley. Well, Matthias Besch can be quite an aggressive, feisty driver. Matthias Vazavier has got form on that front as well. Well, it's going to be down to race control and to the stewards as to whether or not there was maybe a little bit too much physicality there. That was the moment that I thought that uh, maybe it went a little bit too far. It was Besh trying to keep him where he wanted him, boxed in. Well, Vazivier, oh, sorry, Besh, oh, sorry, it was Vazivier trying to keep him yes. boxed in. It was Besh trying to get out from behind the RLR car. If you ask me at that moment, the, 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 the questionable move was probably from the AF Corsa car.